Okay, this is the first video of the uh, HLM package tutorial. Uh, so I'm going to introduce to you what is HLM and where to find it and uh, how to install it. Um, first of all, HGLM is an R package, and R is a project for statistical computing with a homepage like this, www.r-project.org. So, if you know R, you know everything about this. If you don't know R, just go to this page and download it, install. And it's actually easy to learn the syntax uh, language, and also the environment is really flexible for statistical computing. Uh, so if you have, if you are at the R homepage like this, on the left hand side, you go to CRAN for downloading stuff, and uh, you choose just one CRAN mirror from this list. Uh, I usually choose Austria for some reason, but actually you can choose any anyone close to you or you like, and then you uh, end up here. So CRAM means Comprehensive R Archive Network, that's what CRAM means. And here you can install R if you don't have it. There are some explanation that you can find also on this website. On the left hand side you have packages. And uh, it says there are currently 4510 available packages already in the CRAM. And, um, we go to the table of available packages sorted by name. And if you click on H, and uh, there's a list. I think we are at somewhere down here. Here it says HLM hierarchical generalized linear models. Uh, and don't be surprised that there's another package, HGLM MM, in the uppercase letters. It's also hierarchical generalized linear models, but uh, this is implemented by uh, another group. Um, so, if you're interested, you can look at it, look at their package as well. But uh, we are the maintainer of this package, small HLM. Uh, if you click on that, so now we are at this page with hierarchical generalized linear model HLM. Package description here. We have authors, our colleague Madhu that launch, and and down here we have downloads, and this is where you should get the package source. So the source code are all open and uh, to public, so everyone can have access to it. Have uh, Mac OS 10 binary, Windows binary, reference menu, VNet PDF documents here. Some change log what have we done in the past versions and um, some old sources. Um, so, and if you have a Linux system, you can download the source and, and install it from here. And if you have a Mac OS 10 or Windows, you can download the binary and install from these files, or you can directly install it from R. Uh, so this is the website to show you how to find information online. And now I'm going to show you how you can uh, install it directly from R. So I have a Mac. Uh, open the new terminal window. It takes a while. Okay. So. Uh, if you start your R, I started from terminal, you can also start it from, if you install R, you have a user interface also. It's basically the same, you always end up with this larger than uh, sign, with a cursor. And you install, uh, you have the user interface, graphical user interface, you can click on the menu and install packages. But actually, the fastest way is always to call the command install packages. Quotation mark, it doesn't matter if it's single or double. Uh, and you write each of that. Since I have a Mac, I have an X11. So it asks me to choose 
uh, cram mirror from the list. If you're on Linux, you probably have the to type some numbers. On Windows, I think you also have a pop-up window with this. So let's choose Austria again. Double click. So now R is going to load the HLM package from my uh, selected source mirror. Uh, since it recognized that I have a Macintosh system, so it directly download the uh, Mac OS 10 Leopard release of HLM version 1.2-6 and it's installed. Uh, and after installing the package, you can use the library function or the require function to call HLM. It takes a while uh, for some reason. So it's loaded, you have some information telling you which version this is and our author information and how do you get uh, citation for our work. If you use HLM and you want to publish something, you can just call it citation HLM. It tells you how to cite and which paper you should refer to. And this is how you install and load HLM package in R. Uh, some other information, here you have a discussion group. If you go to the website, you also have this Spark report place on RForge. If you click on this link, uh, here's an RForge environment for you to report something that you want us to know. And uh, if you go to this link, discussion here uh, actually you will have a group let's see whether it works and this link would get, lead you to a, a forum or discussion group for this particular package project on RForge uh, and then you can post stuff and ask, our, ask questions or send an email directly to the maintainer uh, it's also okay so that's it. That's how to find our package, how to install it, and how to load it. And enjoy using the package, and thanks for watching.